Of all the paths you take in life, make sure a few of them are dirt. Hi, so I just want to take a little moment to debrief my anomalous action that I did yesterday, which was to turn off my cell phone and my computer for a full 24 hours. I started at 5 a.m. on Sunday and I turned everything back on at 5 a.m. on Monday morning. And this wasn't really a hard one, but it was definitely out of my comfort zone. And the night before, Saturday night, the night before I knew I was gonna turn off the phone on, on Sunday at five, it felt a lot like the night before you have to catch a plane. I wanted to make sure I had all my ducks in a row and that I had done everything that I was supposed to do before I shut everything off. So there was a little bit of anxiety associated with it. And I didn't really have too eventful of a day. Um, it was just nice and quiet and I was able to get my house in order, make things really beautiful. Um, a friend came and visited me at noon and we had to make an appointment for that the night before and stick to it because they knew that they weren't going to be able to get a hold of me. And we had a cocktail together and I love to document my cocktails, but again, uh, I wasn't using any technology, so they went ahead and shot a little picture for me. I cooked myself some apples with butter and cinnamon and just had a really relaxing bath and a generally restful day. So I know that there are cultures that do this. I know that Orthodox Jews um, take a, a Sabbath every week where I think from sundown Friday night to sundown Saturday night, they don't use technology. In fact, they have to enlist neighbor's help in order to do things that uh, normally they would be able to do throughout the week. So it's not that out of the ordinary, I think, for some people. The Amish live like this completely. So in the future, I'd like to try two other things similar to, to this. I'd like to try an Amish day where I shut off my breakers for 24 hours and just live without electricity. And I'd like to try a day where I go car free and do all my errands on foot and uh, see where that leads me. So anyway, all in all, I really recommend doing this. It's a great cleanse. It's a great little break from, you know, the everyday chatter that we're always getting and, and the need to turn to our phones. I'm Camille Scott, and this is Zeno Enthusiast.